All right. So we're back at it again. Got more fusion that we're going to be doing. Uh, we started it last stream. We got a lot done. Got a lot done. And essentially what we learned story-wise, uh, there is an evil version of me who is essentially a parasite who's walking around with my suit. Who ended up taking my suit. Uh, we were infected with the parasite ourselves. And in the process of being affected, the Metroid DNA actually ended up being a cure for the parasite that was within us. And now we no longer uh, get hurt from this said parasite. Uh, the parasite is actually everything that we use to heal and get ammo and all that jazz um, at the moment. So now that we have this new suit, which by the way, <laughs> suits all right. Um, now that we're more into this, just got a new suit, got a bunch of upgrades, bunch of energy tank upgrades already. We, we got a lot done, I feel like, last stream. And I think we're going into like the last sector we haven't explored yet, if I recall. Or I think I still have to talk to the navigation system, which brings out a lot of lore. This is probably the most lore uh, Metroid game I think I've played so far outside of, uh, I know, I guess other M. Hey, Ace, thank you for the quack on the hydrates. I did hear the quack. <laughs> How you doing? Hope your day's going well. I did add you on near. I need to play a lot more though. I have not played too much. Quack. So you're already like level 10. Like I just got the level two. <laughs> there it was. Oh, you didn't hear it either. Was it too low? At the quack? Oh, you're level 12 now. Damn. You're gonna already beat the game before you even get a chance. I mean, it's, I mean, it's a mobile game. Can you really beat it, I guess? But still, <laughs> you're just gonna be like, I'm like, all right, I'm finally getting back to it. I'm level 99. Come at me, bro. <laughs> I'll confirm my mission objective. Uh, how did that X download the Varia suit data? I have not beaten it yet. <laughs> I love the yet part. It's like I'm getting there. That's not yet. I tried doing another summon on that game and I only got, I didn't get really anything. I think like a couple weapons and like, some made up characters, I guess. But not like the main banner ones. Oh, I got 2B and A2, that's it. I was trying to get, oh, not 2B. Uh, 9S, 9S and A2. The only two I've gotten so far. I've been trying to get regular 2B. I have not gotten it yet. I've just been using the free stuff that I've been given. <laughs> Uh, the virus you did it doesn't seem to make any sense at all unless the X unless the X has the ability to process data organically. At any rate, you have the virus suit data. Now you'll be protected from extreme temperatures. Oh yeah, that's right. More importantly, the SAX will no longer be able to freeze you, so you can escape easier. But you're still too weak. That thing is too much for you. <laughs> Thanks, game. Uh, you currently have no way of damaging it. But my simulations indicate that a penetrating weapon like the plasma beam might work. Developing modification data will... Oh, that's right. You told me that's about the plasma beam. I actually think I read about this. There's also a chance I might be able to get the plasma beam by storming a large core X. You did? Okay, we did read this. Yeah, there's nothing about the ice beam, but we have the object again, like an ice missile. Yeah, okay. All right, I gotta go to Sector 5. All right, cool. Uh, I got some decent summons lately. I got the Atomino crew. We got them all. Nice. Bro. Steak. How you doing, bro? Bro. <laughs> uh, they make it really easy to learn enough crystal thingies to do more summons. They really do. And sometimes I might just like turn on my phone. I know they have like those free videos I guess you can watch. I might just click on one and then just multitask and do something else. 
And then I think I maybe got like, I think I've, the most I've gotten so far is like 50. But I've never gotten anything more than 50 in the uh, currency. Crystal thingamajiggers. You eating so good? <laughs> what you eating? What we having for dinner today? I had some teriyaki chicken with some mashed potatoes and broccoli. I ate somewhat healthy. And I just pitched my mom about work for an hour. <laughs> so better baked salmon with the little rice peas. Sorry about the the mom bit. But I'm I'm glad to hear the food. Actually, it sounds really good. We were just briefly talking about a gotcha in your game. <laughs> Race and veggies for me. I've been trying to eat to be more healthy, but I also bought things to make a key. So I'm the same. Uh, I had a lot of takeout the last couple of days prior to probably the last two. The last two we've actually been eating in, which is nice. And I want more in and less out. I mean, eating out far too often, <laughs> especially near the end of the weeks. Um, I just gotta get away from fast food. We've been having way too much fast food. I would like to eat better. All right. You need to download data for the ice missiles. As you might expect, the data room here is secured. Level three security hatches are yellow. Release the security lock and download data as usual. And experiment with those new missiles. They will help be helpful. Okay. You know what to do, go to it. All right, gotta get to the data room. Cool beans. Oh no, my mom is dope. Oh, sorry. Work sucks though. Just to, just good to bet you buy it every once in a while. Okay, gotcha. I miss heard that. <laughs> yeah, I feel the work thing. I'm still in work clothes, by the way. I didn't feel like changing today. I'm just like, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Change into clothes and wear for like an hour or two, and then get ready for bed. I want more laundry. Where what I got for now, I'll be fine. All right, so we're looking for ice, ice missiles. Uh, how do I shoot this? All right. <laughs> trying to remember, like, how do I shoot? I might want to go down. I'm gonna go down first. Uh, the button down is the first thing to come off when I walk to my car. <laughs> first thing I do is just literally, uh, I can't go that way. All right, All right answer my question. Uh, just take the untucked shirt out of its tuxation uh, spot. I untuck the shirt. I just tuck it. I just take out the tux tuxations. Gotta get out of that. So I can breathe a little bit. <laughs> That's one reason why I want to start eating better. So I just feel like I just put so much weight on during the pandemic. I have a weird, weird feeling we might, I don't know. I got a weird hunch that we're going to be going back into lockdown again. I'm just trying to prepare myself for that, at least for work. I know that for sure. I don't know if it'll be as bad. I don't know. Just got a weird hunch. My job was telling me there's a good chance. That's why I'm like, I don't know. Did you just give shout out to mistake? What did I, did I tell you you could do that? <laughs> but you're good. Uh, I would love to play no game one day. <laughs> Floor is number one. Floor is number one. In, oh, gotcha. Also, I just realized 
We're in the Winter Wonderland. My volume up. We're number one and nothing good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, every time I think I think my area is like properly I think pretty sure like top five in the country based on like criminal rate. There's a there's a lot of arrest in my area. <laughs> Uh, I've gained like 10, 15, maybe 20 pounds since late 2019. I had knee surgery and then followed up with a pandemic as soon as I got the okay to be climbing again. And then I was sad. Oh, I'm sorry. My work is kind of leaning towards allowing for full remote work again. And I'm going to jump on the train so fast. Yeah, mine's kind of doing that too. We had a meeting last week. They kind of hinted to us that we're like, we might be going back to full remote temporarily. But they still like the idea of mostly working in the office. Which honestly, I don't hate working in the office. Actually, I kind of like it. I sound weird. I don't know. I think I actually just like, actually like the people I'm working with. <laughs> They're not bad people. That's why I'm like, I, I, I don't mind it for that reason. <laughs> They're kind of relaxed, which is nice. Yo, DFB, how you doing? How's... Literally everything. How is everything? Okay, I can't go that way. I need the uh, security thingamajigger. Oh yeah, I can absorb that now. I keep seeing those stuff fly around. I'm like, I can absorb the blue. The blue does not kill me. Thank you very much. So I can open the red though. Alright. Yeah, I gotta look at the security room. Alright, just wanna make sure. I hate working in the office. I'm sorry. Do we get over there? I would like to get over there. It looks like I can. Wait a minute, hold up. Maybe that's why I was trying to go up before. Gonna blow everything up along the way. All right, maybe not. <laughs> just looks like an area where I could like somehow blow us up and just get in. Uh, do be when are you cracking open tail consorto to give it a spin? Say what now? What did I miss? something can I just go through here yeah I can't hit the switch what am I doing <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just everywhere uh, I forgot to ask you a very important question I did put the lime in the coconut I'm sorry uh, yeah I run fast it's a very expensive PS1. Oh, that's right. Did I hear about this? I feel like I heard about this. How are you today? I am so tired. <laughs> I'm actually not that tired. I, actually, to be completely honest, I'm not that tired. I figured they'd be more tired. Secret door, hello. Um, I'm feeling pretty good. Actually, I'm having, I don't know, I'm having a better day. But these have been good. At least today's been good. I haven't had, I'm not feeling too bad. I think I'm just getting into the mindset of I can actually sleep in a little bit tomorrow before I actually have to work. I think that's what I'm happy about. But I'm, I'm, I'm doing good. I'm also just trying to figure out what this whole secret path is even for. 
This makes no sense. This makes no sense at all. <laughs> Uh, anyone want to do a sour bomb with me? Oh, damn. That's a steak. I'm also good, Barry. I got an email from that orientation day. Might get moved up a week. And I was treasure hunting in my China cabinet before I move it. Nice. So, yeah, I moved up a week. So. That means you're going to be starting your job, what, like a week later now? Up a week. So it's later, right? Uh, up a week? Yeah. Yeah, totally. <laughs> uh, I only have whiskey, Jaeger, and Angry Orchards. <laughs> well, take it. I actually have not bought alcohol in a while. Which, I mean, I guess is technically a good thing. Sort of. <laughs> Define good. <laughs> um, I haven't actually really bought alcohol in a while. I think the last time I bought alcohol was probably right before the Royal Rumble this year. That's probably, that might have been the last time I bought anything. Uh, Ace, I will trade you some Jaeger. Ace, let's do neural handshakes. Deal, it's in the freezer at the moment, so I hope you don't mind that. Also, if you don't know wrestling or Royal Rumble, that was like, I don't know, February? Oh, it's been like six months? Holy crap. At least six or seven. Time fly by. Um... That will be next week. I have two sealed gym bottles that are 50 plus years old. Hell yeah. Damn dude, it is August. I know. Also, why aren't you just blowing up? I'm just trying to think. I'm like, okay, I know in wrestling terms. That's how I'm going by at the moment very briefly. Like WrestleMania was around like April-ish. Um, so that means Royal Rumble is at least like a month or two prior to that, which means it's been a very, I just realized what I have to do. Okay. Get your little butt over here. Oh, this is a tricky little puzzle. All right. I have to somehow, how can I lure you? There we go. Excellent. Ow. Hey, how can I run across this? Wait, hold up. I think it's gonna work. I think I can go this way right now. Weird. Hey, right, I might carry on. My wayward. Boy. Uh, you ever get into? Any backyard wrestling? I have not. It's been two weeks since you look at me. I am that now. I look into your soul. <laughs> All right, let's save as I'm just dying. So I need some type of upgrade that'll allow me to run on these things. So I currently cannot, I mean, other than when they're like that, like when they're tall, I can't touch them. Can I break this? Not with what I got. <laughs> uh, I have, but I have not gotten the back of wrestling. I've gotten into like wrestling with my brothers when I was a kid. Like we would always just wrestle in like in our living room safely, but I, I think we didn't go like anything serious. Like I had an older brother, so we always just say he was the Undertaker and I was Kane, which you know, red hair and all <laughs> would make sense. <laughs> Can't touch this. 
It's trying to fix this. Um, also, this emo combo amuses me. I think Number had the same thing. <laughs> was it Number? I can't forget. It was either you or Number that I actually started using. I think it was actually... Maybe it was Number. But it's just like patting the dumper butt. <laughs> Imagine it was just like dumper quake and you're just like... <laughs> anyway. <laughs> uh, love me some homemade backyard wrestling videos. I didn't catch up. <laughs> See what you did there. It's just a little, little bop on the Metroid. Actually, it works really well. I'm also about to die. Whatever happened to my health? I am just getting hit by everything. I hit the wrong thing. <laughs> That's for Beery. Jeez, these enemies are ridiculous. Oh, that's that's just great. <laughs> there we go. Thank you for health. <laughs> High fives for Adam. <laughs> Everyone's getting some form of pets or high fives here. Okay, so I can go for the data room. I want to actually sort of go for the uh, all the way back to the beginning in the heal room so I don't die. <laughs> Much better. Kids just get a little pat on the head and just a little happy face. This is all fine and bandy. <laughs> all right, listen, I'm going to die on either run. <laughs> I'm gonna make a restore point just in case. So I'm almost there. I don't wanna mess up. And we have to redo everything. Oh dear. Alright, we're fine. I think. No. We're almost fine though. This is not fine. Just get over there. All right, we're good. We're gonna live. We're fine. <sighs> okay. <laughs> These people are tearing me apart. All right, now that I'm back here, <laughs> let's explore. Oh, all right down with us. Can I grab this somehow? Hmm. Okay, so that breaks it. from underneath. I'm just gonna like, I just wanna, I just wanna break it. <laughs> How can I get this thing? I don't have the feeling I have to run from like one room to another to another and just run for it. Cause I want that. <laughs> the hell are you? I am just not even gonna bother with that. Thank you. 
It's giving me a little pat on the head. Alright, where are you upgrade? Every move you make. I will find you. Oh, can't get it yet. All right. Yeah, maybe any power bombs. Maybe. We'll come back. <laughs> I feel like I'm getting too far ahead of myself and I can't grab. I'll be watching. Oh, can't you see? This upgrade belongs to me. <laughs> I pour a time by Christopher Walken. Into data room. Give me my upgrades, please. Ice effect added to missiles. Use it to freeze enemies. Cool. We can freeze people. How does this work? It just works. Cool. <laughs> like, how does this work? Oh, okay. I do wonder. I wonder nothing. Never mind. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> oh jeez. Uh, first off, I freeze you. Ah, -ha! still works. Just not sure if I like the idea of this being. Souls. Right, let's see. Can I just like. Damn, that's actually really close. I think I need that last one to be closer to uh, over here. Watch out. Dang it. <laughs> Alright, I can aim. Nope. <laughs> I cannot aim. Confirmed. If I aim left, I go down. Oh, I. F the enemy deserve that. There we go. All right, cool. Another energy tank. That's actually really good. <laughs> I am very happy with that. Uh, let's see. So we got an energy tank. Went all the way down. What if I actually go all the way up? Can I? I think I've fallen too far at this point to actually go up. Oh, I know I can't because I need to go to the other door. All right, so we need to go down. I'm glad I was able to figure that out. <laughs> Good job, me. Aha. Okay. That makes sense. I've learned a thing. You can freeze the pillars with your missiles. That's a new one. Uh, where are you going? Have a time limit? Sort of. Get through this? Actually, can I just run through it? Nope. <laughs> Good enough. Or else I can blow it up. Nope. I might have messed that up. Let me try again. I wonder if one of the enemies actually ended up latching onto it. Kind of like what that one did. Oh, we get 
through this. Unless maybe you can be like an anti thing. Maybe you cling on to, I don't know. I was hoping maybe it'd be some way I could just break this. It's gotta be something. Be worried if I can't just like jump on it. Unless I can. No. <laughs> so you're like, maybe I could just freeze it and then roll. All right, let's just break like everything on the ground. This is usually the thing about Metro games. If you can't figure something out, blow everything up. This doesn't make sense though. <laughs> and they would lead me into a room that I can't climb up. Used all my upgrades. The only thing I have not really used. Well, all right, let's try this. Oh, all right. So, I got nothing. And maybe I have to blow up the roof here or something. I don't know. So I can't go back. Actually, could I? Quack, indeed. <laughs> I number. Thing I'm like, I actually could. I think I need to run really fast. Oh. There we go. All right. We good. <laughs> also, quack. That was a quacktacular discovery. Am I right? All right. So I need you to get big. By murdering you, getting you over here. Oops. Come on. Come on. Good boy. Good parasite. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Progress. Ow. That wasn't worth it. That's real good. All right. Quack. Quack. Actually, can I get the other blue thing, please? Where's my blue ice board friend? Is that the only one? Okay, never mind. Carry on. So this is a shortcut back. Cool. I was say, there's really not much else to do here. <laughs> this one's actually a pretty small room. I think we're starting to get to the point of where we might have to start backtracking to other areas we've been to just to discover more in those areas. There's really not much, not much else to really, really... Oh, I just realized what this was for. All right, never mind. <laughs> it's just had, just had discovery. <laughs> Actually, yeah, good point. What the heck is in there? <laughs> this is a place I would like to figure out and discover. Oh, oh, there we go. Can I shoot you? No. Okay, then. 
That is something I'll have to come back for. Can I freeze this? Can I aim? <laughs> Next question. <laughs> First question. Can I hit it? Second question. Can I hit it? The hell is that? I look like a ship. Or like something like this, but like really big. <laughs> if I find out that's my ship, <laughs> like my old Samus ship, I'm gonna. <laughs> oh, that would be funny. I hope it's not. <laughs> like if I find out this parasite took over not only my armor but my entire ship. Wouldn't that just be grand? Alright, seriously, where is this upgrade? Oh, that's right, power bombs. Alright, can't get that. We'll come back. Yeah, seriously, what is that? It's like a Mantine thing? It looks like these things, but really big. Yes, it does terrify me. Oh, I could climb up there. I just realized that. I go back. Never mind. I guess we're not going back. We'll go back later. Uh, emergency. Oh, in sector three? Yeah, three. It's going on sector three. And from the depth of space, BRE, and BRE here is nerfed for this before a nuclear explosion disintegrates everything in the surrounding area. Nerf this. All right, emergency in sector three. The area could melt down soon. It seems the main boiler's cooling unit is malfunctioning. This could easily destroy the entire research station as it would likely trigger the auto-destruct explosives. Why does every single area that we ever go to Always just have something that self-destructs in a Metroid game. It's like the common theme. If there isn't something exploding in a Metroid game, there's a problem. Alright, so something's about to blow up. We have about six minutes. Okay, cool. So I actually, I'm timed on this. So I have six minutes to get down there before it blows up. <laughs> because booms are pretty. They are. I'm also trying to remember what Sector 3 was. Alright, so I have to go down right, 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 all right. Hurry up to Sector 3 and access the control room to the side of the boiler room. Most of the systems in PYR are down because of this. Again, we know who to blame. The SAX must have hacked into the system control file with impressive intelligence. Yeah, my objective is pretty clear. <laughs> There's little time. Hurry to Sector 3. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not talking to me. I gotta move. All right, cool. So no pressure. There's a timer. You have six minutes to get to sector three. Just pausing. So is that 52? All right. I was like, just pausing. I actually stopped the clock. <laughs> I had to test it out. All right, which one's sector three? All right. Probably the one that says sector three. And we should be able to get down there in six minutes. <laughs> Maybe even three. <laughs> I don't even want to save at this point. <laughs> I just want to go. Alright, move out of the way, everyone. Y'all about to die. 
friends have to meet a savior, little butt. Um, can I go down? Yeah, you're right. Alright, I'm actually trying to remember, like, what was in Sector 3? <laughs> Alright, this is the, uh, pyro, pyro looking level. Alright, so I can go down, just go all the way down. Cool. Simple enough. Do I have to run? I have to run. I forgot. Alright, here we go. No pressure. I didn't do it right. Alright. Here we go. I'm already waiting for like some big enemy to just jump at me and be like, surprise. I think I'm waiting for it. Oh, I can go through here now. I've never been through here. I can withstand the extreme temperatures. I'm just gonna go. Try not to fall. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> we'll be good. We'll be, be fine. There we go. Almost made it out of there without falling into lava. New enemies too. Yeah, how many hits do you take? All right, where's this boiler room? Like, we gotta be close. Okay, we got a couple more rooms. Might be kind of get close here. <laughs> I actually might want to freeze these enemies, climb them. Yeah, it does work. Cool. Demon. No worries, there's only three more minutes. <laughs> Alright, these big guys are just the best. <laughs> Maybe more hits. There we go. Maybe they take less hits when they're sleeping. It. No time. At this point, like I want to fight every enemy. I'm trying to get into the mindset of I can't. Can we? Sorry about that. Where were we? All right, we're about to blow up. <laughs> like, where am I at? Explosions. Thank you. They are good. They had a technical question. They couldn't get their TV to work. I got the work. I restarted it. Uh, how are the wife and kids? Uh, oh, yeah. Wife's great. Kids great. They're fantastic. <laughs> it was my mom and my brother. <laughs> we pushing through. Oh, we made it. Cool. Hey. Blow this up. Alright, how do I get up there? First off. Oh. Don't tell me what 
the time is. Oh no. Oh cool. I have a feeling I'm about to fight something. It usually indicates you're about to fight something. You're alive? I'm like looking at this thing, I'm like, why are you alive? Why are you a human? Nope, you're just a parasite. There we go. Grab it. There we got something. Wide beam availability recovered. Beam widens dramatically. Is he a human or is it a dancer? Cooling you and operational. We did it, peeps. We got it. It's all, everything's cool. It's all cool. I'm waiting for something to pop up on the screen and be like, I am your father. <laughs> How's my whoa? I don't think this is a plasma beam, but it's like so cool. Oh, you're cool. <laughs> Triple pew pews. All these purple pew pews. All a bunch of pews. That's all I want to do. I go pew pew. Might take my dog out. You want to go pew pew? <laughs> Just woof. Which in dog language means pew. All right. Um, clean operational navigation room. Cool. Literally. All right. I still can't damage them. <laughs> I can charge beam them though. Guess that's enough. I kind of forgot I can just go through these areas now. Oh, right. Can't do that, though. Can I go up here? I feel like I can. But I can't. What kind of gun gamer are you? Close range, mid range, long range, and wide range. Uh, I, pull, I prefer my wide shots. Okay, it's a lot stronger, that's for sure. That, uh, that was not dealing that much damage before. These, I'm like, these guys took a while to kill. <laughs> last time I did this. I guess I explored everywhere here, so I just gotta get out of here. I just like fall somewhere. I just don't want to deal with these. <laughs> All right, well I'm gonna just jump in the lava. That's fine. It's a whole new definition to the floor is lava, <laughs> cause it's literally lava. Yeah, 69 energy. All right. I need to get out of here. I'll get myself killed. <laughs> nice. Nice. <clears throat> Almost pulled an echo there. <laughs> Oh, jeez. Just let me, let me just climb in peace. Wait, is there an upgrade I missed over there? Hold up. No. This is a data room. All right, so I, I just need to get out of here. <laughs> I'm trying to see if there's anywhere I missed. I literally see nothing. I think we've done everything. Can I just jump? Just 
Excuse me. Excuse me. Just let me go. I want to go how? I want to wait for the ground to clear up. There we go. Making their way downtown. Walking fast. Actually, we're kind of walking slow, but it's fine. It's all, it's all, it's all Gucci. It's fine. Down here, save up and find out what our uh, mysterious shady computer AI wants us to do next. Hey there. All right, the X mimicked a crew member. It all makes sense now, does it? The X can absorb the memories and knowledge of their prey. What an astonishing finding! Uh, what's on you find headquarters where are uh but don't you find it strange this could have destroyed the station with the x in it not to mention the sax unusual for a self-preserving species like the x unless it's like some other planet unless your presence is even a greater threat a threat to the existence of x elsewhere this is only a hypothesis perhaps their survival instinct is in conflict with their newly borrowed intelligence don't let your guard down yet. The X are still a threat. Samus, I see bio signs on the habitation deck. Survivors? The yeah, affected crewmen you saw have survived. Uh, maybe there is a chance the signs emanate from here. Is your objective clear? We're going back to the beginning. All right, I've just restored power to the main elevator. Use it to return and look for any survivors. Okay. I mean, you can essentially go everywhere except for lock four. So that's cool. All right, but everything's unlocked. We can go back there. Uh, I kind of just want, I really just want to explore. <laughs> oh, that's all I want to do at the moment. I just want to explore a little bit. I want to explore and find some like hidden goodies somewhere in an area that I couldn't get to before. But now I can because you know, I've got the upgrade or, you know, whatever. It's a long elevator. <laughs> All right, so this is where, oh. Hey, All right. Let's see, how can I do this? Easy. And that's how you get that upgrade. How many missiles we have? 115, it's not bad. All right, see where I gotta go. Cut an eye, Joe. Uh, so I could go. I guess I'm really just going to the target area. There's no really, there's not much else else to explore. There's like a few spots. It's not that much. Is there a spot down here, was it? Yeah, just explore this whole area if I can. Oh, I try. I couldn't go through here. Oh, cool. So Ridley's in the game. That's confirmed. <laughs> uh, you know what? Let's just. All right. First question. How are you still alive? Second question. Why am I bother asking? Third question. Why are you here to begin with? Ah, uh, spoilers. <laughs> Nonsense. Seriously, though, why? 
There's not a much ranking without a Ridley. <laughs> a Ridley Riddle. It is a Ridley Riddle. <laughs> it really is. I fought you in Super Metroid. How are you still alive? I fought you in New Mission. How are you still alive? A few times. Fought you in Samus Returns. I've, this is, now you're here. Shocker. You better actually kill the parasite. Like, I want you to kill the parasite. Thinking you're killing me and then just like feeling like you're getting revenge. But in reality, really, you just destroy the parasite. Or maybe the parasite's keeping you here so you become Ridley X. Or something. Which would be devastating. <laughs> parasite Ridley would probably be terrifying. But Ridley's frozen, so maybe I could use some freezing attacks to beat Ridley if I fight him. Which, let's be realistic, we're fighting Ridley at some point. You always fight Ridley. Alright, let's just save up. Go to the habitat room. I know what's going on here. Something's about to happen. Oh, hi. Wanna... There you go. <laughs> Thank you. Kind of want to go to all three of these rooms. I want to go all the way to the top. It's up here first. Got a feeling that's good. Drop me. Nope. Okay, so I can't go through here. I can drop through here. That brings me nowhere but back here. Drop down through there. Drop through there. Can't really do much here. All right. <laughs> Start on the left. Also, considering it looks like there's like running panels, let's break them. There we go. All right, so who we got? Vessels. Cool. Uh, nothing else. Really, nothing else. Oh, I. That's where I was supposed to go. I need to go back to the top. All right. Well, I mean, I got missiles. Can't complain. <laughs> All right, so it's the second room here. It's like right here. Is this where I need to be? How do I open that up? So I found out that you can play dominoes in Red Dead 2 and I've been playing just that for the past hour. Yeah, there's... There's a lot of extra little things in Red Dead that they just offer you. There's like, hey, by the way. Excuse me. Um, Blackjack. <laughs> but I got a feeling there's something in here. Hey, maybe it's not... Up, I need to go, but I need to look underneath. Or maybe, maybe I, I don't know. <laughs> I had nothing. Oh, oh, like I'll play Domino's for hours. Hell yeah. them dominoes. Alright, seriously, how do I get through that door? Biosigns and hypotaching deck, check for survivors. Hmm. 
I guess I saw these things. I break the glass. I remember those things from Mother M. Wait a minute. I think. They look familiar. Seriously, how do I get to this thing? <laughs> I think this is where I need to go. But I'm at where I need to go. There's nothing to do here. Other than... Are you winning, son? Not yet, Dad. How are you doing? We made it to... We saw the boiler explosion. I have just discovered this. And I can't get to it. Do I need to run? I run. Nope. Also quack. All right, this is actually kind of confusing. Uh, Cause I know the type of door is one of those doors where you have to like shoot the beam, and the door opened up, but there's no beam to shoot. So oh, quack is right. Tell me what I gotta do. Come on, monsters. <laughs> Talking to the monsters behind the screen. <laughs> yeah, I'm a little stuck. I feel like it's something to do with like the floors down below. But you can't get back up once you fall through. Like a door like this, you have to be on the other side to shoot it. Hmm. Yeah, how are you doing today, Llama? How's, how's your day been going? I'm confused. It's like, what's the definition of insanity? <laughs> It is me at this very moment. So I keep checking back here, thinking I'm missing something, and I feel like maybe I'm not missing anything. Maybe something I don't have. I feel like the navigation system would tell you. You have to go back to a different room that I've already been to. I might go, I'm just gonna explore for a bit. Cause I don't think I can do anything here yet. Like there has to be a switch somewhere. And there's a couple of unexplored areas. Well, I'll look around for a bit. If I find nothing, I'll come back and then I'll start stressing after that. So I can't go in there. All right, let's just go through here. So there's a couple spots I never really got to go to when I was over here last time. See, I just want to check every single little freaking cry out loud. I got, I got cake. <laughs> All right, well. That's actually a good cake. It's an ice cream cake. My brother's birthday was a couple days ago. I 
I don't think I've ever been here at Waymont. Either way, can't go through here. <laughs> so, good to know. Oh, so I can't go through here either. Alright, so I'm kind of screwed. As I take the secret path? Should be over here? Somewhere, maybe? It's somewhere. I feel like I was there. Yeah, I'm gonna know it's somewhere here. I'm just gonna explore this area. Maybe I'm feeling maybe there's like a switch somewhere that I have not found. Like it's in a different area, and I need to go to find that switch so I can progress. That's my current thought process, but I can also be completely wrong. <laughs> and it's really nowhere to go. All right, I might, I might actually ask for a hint. <laughs> So I'm really not sure. I'm not officially giving in yet, but I, I I might actually ask for a hint if anyone knows. This one's a bit confusing. There's gotta be something in that room that I was in that I'm missing. Like when I'm falling through, it's gotta be something. Cause I can't explore anywhere else. The game doesn't allow me. Not yet, at least. All right, I'm going the wrong way. All right, so back up we go. George. Maybe something in here? Quack? I did that far too soon. <laughs> Alright, now seriously. Where the frickin' tarnation? You know, these whipper snappers. Where the hell am I supposed to go? <laughs> Take a bite and think about this. Obviously, these type of doors unlock, as I mentioned, based on a switch. Unless. Never mind. So they open some type of switch. You have to shoot the switch, right? There's also these animals back here. Maybe they're trying to lead to something. Like, can I jump through this? And then jump through this? <laughs> can I break the glass? Are they just teasing me? <laughs> I 
I have a weird thing like maybe I have to like break both switches and then climb up. I went the wrong way, by the way. That wouldn't make sense. Unless you're supposed to like shoot yourself up. Wait, hold up. Go back. I might have an idea. I'll give it a try. Maybe I'll fail. So I have not tried this really in this game. I've tried it once. I know it works. But I don't know if this is what I'm supposed to do. But we'll try it. So I'm going to go ahead and shoot both doors. All right, so I'm through here. Oh, wait, whoa, wait a minute. Oh, it's fine. I think I found it. I think I hit the jackpot. Ow. There we go. All right. Lock disengage, gates opening. Animals are free. We did it, Sonic. I ain't just want to take a bite. I am hurt. Oh, my friend. I'm. We have saved the creatures. As a. Uh, I guess that's that. Is that really it? Edicoons and Dracoras freed. Proceed to navigation room. Yeah, that's it. All right. So I guess we'll go back south. There's not much else. Save the creatures. For what purpose do they have? Not a clue. But we saved them. So I just feel rude. Chewing to the microphone. I'm also trying to read, I can't. All right. Edekuns and Dracoras. I have met these intelligent beings before. They seem to recognize me as well. How unusual to meet again here. In the past, they've helped me unleash abilities I didn't know I had. But where do they run to? Hope they're safe. Hmm. I'm just dreading to know. I'm dreading to know. Um, dre you get the point. So the survivors were not human. Most unfortunate. Oh, come on. We can now confirm the deaths of all crew members. I imagine this was the case, but I had hoped it wasn't so. I bet, I believe the X only infected humans for knowledge. That form is too weak for battle. I am sure the others were merely food for the X. Damn, AI, it's dark. <laughs> Samus, I think they are evolving, growing stronger. So am I. Uh, some are appearing that resist your current weapons. HQ anticipated this and sent power bomb data as soon as the hardware team finished it. Is your objective clear? Yeah, yeah, blow them up. <laughs> Download it immediately. Our choice of data rooms is limited to this one. And Sector 5. We're going back there. That's where the Mantine looking thing was at. I don't think I really want to go to this one. <laughs> I'm going to be terrified that I like, come back one day and just find Ridley's gone. That's what I'm waiting for. 
Like, I feel like the Parasite's gonna uh, be using Ridley as like a last second resort. Just being like, you know what? We gotta un unleash the Ridley, you know? I'm waiting for it. <laughs> That's what's gonna happen. Now let me take the elevator and take a bite. Alright, it tastes really good. Alright, let's go down. I have to go to the navigation room. You've been to this dealer room before. I'll show you its position again. I know it's clear. I was just weird it wasn't letting me through. And the game was kind of like forcing you to be like, you know, you need to do this again. <laughs> Why? Because I am the game and I said so. Also, wait, so I think you gave me a hydration reminder like over an hour ago. I'm not sure if I ever said thank you for it, but I just want to say thank you now. <laughs> just thought about it. <laughs> but thank you. All right, how do I get to this? It's gotta be power bombs. The middle one for sure is power bombs, but this one, I think it's all about power bombs. Yeah, that's the freaking thing. All right, let's see what's in here. I wanted to be something good. It's missiles. I'm happy with that. I figured it had to be something. It's, it's definitely like a giant man, 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 a time like a thing, man time. <laughs> it's just a really big man time. That's all it is. Wait, can I actually run through this? I forgot. If I can, I can't do it from here. Uh, I like the wide beam. <laughs> I really like it a lot. I don't know. Sorry, stop the music kind of terrified me for a moment. All right, uh, yeah, this way. Here we go. Day of the room. And power bombs. Cool. That's a ball, hold R and press B. Okay. Starting to melt a little, I apologize. <laughs> We're good. All right, I can't go that way. Sick. 
sick. I like how different it is in this game. Alright. Um I need to not go this way. Alright, that's not good. Say so that parasite thing is gone. They all gone? They're all gone. Oh, that's a new enemy. Can I blow this up? Um, wait a minute, hold up, go back. I don't get out. First off, I don't like fighting an enemy that like completely restores everything. I'm already terrified about that. But... So SAX has been here, but how do I, so SAX has the ability to destroy those parasites. Like the big ones I can get through before. And then SAX is just like, eh, I'm just gonna blow everything up. Cause I'm SAX. Cool. But then how... How do I get out? Is there a power bomb area that I'm missing? Has to be. I am, I'm missing something. And that's just a decoy. I'm actually kind of confused. Again. Can I blow the ground up? I can. Oh no! Oh no, 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 you don't see me. Don't jump, don't jump, don't jump, don't jump, don't jump, don't jump, dog. She's marking. <laughs> get, get, my, get away, get, get my way, get away now. Mark. I don't want to do anything. Leaving? Gotta go. Okay. Bye. Okay. <laughs> Get that power tank up, bomb tank upgrade thing in my digger. I kind of wanted to use it on SAX just to see if I could do any damage. But I'm like, I don't think this is going to turn out very well if I do this, so let's not. <laughs> okay, I won't lie. This might be the most terrifying metric game I've played. 
only because you're running from yourself. That's terrifying. All right, so the two upgrades I can probably go, go to get now. Words. Okay, let's do this. But yeah, now who's alive? <laughs> Not you. <laughs> no, sorry. That's that looking. All right. M my cake's almost done, but it is slowly melting. That's why I'm a little worried. Power bomb? Ah. Okay then. Is that to open that finally? So now I could probably explore here. Figure out what's in here. Start down low. Power bomb upgrade. All right. That might have been too soon. That's fine. Or that. So I have to use you to get across. Interesting. So it's like a little paddle. Like a little a pal platform. Damn it. <laughs> I like this concept. It's different. Eh, I don't think so. We'll try. Dang it. I need to get it like right in the center. Then I can do it. I barely made. <laughs> Maybe it's going to be close. Yeah. It's going to be like right on top of that second platform. If I want like any shot at it. I don't think so. We'll try. Yeah, damn. How far are you gonna be out for that one? I feel like you'd be very, very far out. That one was like barely too close. All right, this one's really gotta be far out. And you just gotta like jump for it. Dang it. <laughs> I'm using the wrong ability. Uh, I might have a chance here. There we go. You mother... F okay. <clears throat> Words. <laughs> Same my problem. It's like I'm trying to aim. But I keep... I'm letting go too soon. Or I'm shooting too late. Or... Well, I'm letting go on the button too soon. For my ice missiles. That was also a poor jump. Oh, for crying out loud. <laughs> I can aim. There we go. Might make it. Nope. <laughs> it's close. It's a tough upgrade. I really wanted that was a power bomb one. That's why I'm like this. I feel like this could be really important. I had it. This might be enough. 
Okay. No, no, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> oh. It's, it's fine. We'll make it. That's too far out. Wait, so can I like... I should do. If I can chomp. <laughs> All right, good. Oh my God. All right, we're gonna make it. <laughs> We're gonna make it. I promise myself I'll make it. I need a bite. Let me take a bite. Maybe I'll give me enough. Enough oomph. Not enough. Almost enough. Need one more oomph. And maybe that face because it was good cake. I really could just like sneak in there and then shoot the Thoka in there. Like, I mean, it's far more difficult than it should be. That's too far out. I'm not giving it a chance to get closer. Has to be like just right. Maybe. All right. I need to figure out how to get to this. Let's let's make a save point <laughs> or store point. I mean, then we'll try to figure this out. All right. Uh, I'm just gonna jump. Actually, you know what? Even better. Or blow this up, see what blows up. Nothing. Okay. I can just jump for it. Cool. All right, God, <laughs> that took a very long time. Apologize. At least we got it. That's a bit frustrating though on that one. So you had to be like just just right maybe he has it to i'm still worried what that is what well, my first thought was like i thought it was my ship i'm thinking it's like one of those man to looking things i'm shooting at which is like a bigger version i did think at one point maybe it could have been ridley but it's, it's not ridley <laughs> really still frozen and not as big also i think it's definitely flying a lot faster than it did before like closely. Alright, let's blow everyone up. There's my missile. Oh, it's just regular bombs? Dang. Come on, that's all I needed. I need like a power bomb to get to that. Alright, well. 
Well, we'll try to get both bombs. Give this a try. Wait, so if that's... How do you get to this then? Oh. Really? <laughs> just jumped through it? That was an accident? <laughs> Alright, well that's that. So I just gotta get a navigation right. Alright. Let's get out of here. I mean, it was essentially, I think, nearly 100% of this room, unless I'm missing, like, a secret area. I don't think I'm missing anything. Other than that one spot I can't get to yet. So I'd say, like, 99% explored. I need to save. I mean, all right, don't get me wrong, we have a lot of missiles. We already have, like, 14 power bombs. This is great. Like, we're making progress. I need to take a bite. Samus, return to your ship. I have important information. Hmm. Don't blow it up. <laughs> Sorry, I'm only blowing up the station. <laughs> Wait, why am I going back to my ship? Something's about to blow up. What's happening? It's not the boiler room. I'm also just curious why you just can't give me the information here. Oh shit. Power bomb? Yeah. So because I'm like in the sight and it won't like all right, I can touch it when it's frozen. I figured this would be something I could. Oh, I could just go in. Hi, Ridley. Oh, you're alive. Cool. Are we about to fight? No, you're a corpse. Thank goodness. <laughs> the hell are you? I was blowing him up. They're just not even worth my time. Oh, wait a minute. Should I kept running? I stopped because I was like, wait a minute, there's like a thing here. Somewhere. Power bombs, cool. Missiles, gladly take. Can I just walk through here? Awesome. Uh, let's see. I do feel like maybe I should go down through here though. Maybe. Maybe not. Alright, I'll jump through here. Well, it's my ship down here, right? Can't go to level 4 lock yet. This is so ominous. All right, head to the ship. What's going on? Guess we're saving. Mm hmm. Hey, Sever, how you doing? Just finish and take my brother gave me.
How's, how's everything? How's your drawer cons? I'm sorry, I just wanted to finish up so I can stop chewing and stream. <laughs> just pondering life's great questions. Did I eat today? Do I need to eat today? Do I need sleep? <laughs> You're all good. I just hate chewing and talking. Now I got stuck in my tooth. I have also hit the comfortability of not being comfortable in my chair. So also, sorry, hit my mic. <laughs> but yeah, I, uh, yeah, I have not eaten. Oh, cool. That's good. <laughs> it's always good. I am sorry to hear that. It's not good. Just moving. Uh, the main silo of the reactor has gone offline. Crap. That's why all elevators and station systems are down. Elevators and hatches won't work. This doesn't bode well. If you can get to this point, you may be able to start the auxiliary power system. Then we can figure out the main silo went offline. It's clear, but how do I get there? By the way, I actually have to return here to tell you some strange creatures aborted your ship. I confirmed that they were not ex-host and gave them a birth. Do you know anything of these strange creatures? Were they the source of the healthy bioscience earlier? Very well then, their presence in the midst of this disaster must have significance. I will keep them here. <laughs> so we ended up saving these mod, uh, little creatures. Uh, which still remind me, I think they're from Other M. So remember those things from Mother M, something like that. Um, but yeah, they they, they, they board my ship, I guess. So yeah, pets. Hey, yesterday it's fine. Oh, okay, it's totally fine. Eat something. They seem like good guys. <laughs> they are. I'm trying to figure out. How to get to where I need to be. <laughs> and I am just going to figure that out by blowing up everything. You're new. Oh, uh, there we go. Found it. Reactor silo. Awesome. Yeah, so do you know much about fusion, by the way, Kevin? <laughs> Just wanted to double check on you with that. Because I did not realize how lore heavy this was going to be for a Metroid game. No, precisely nothing? Okay. Uh, essentially, there's an evil Samus. That's about all I can really say. And it feels like a horror movie. <laughs> and it's great. I know it's a Metroid game. You you know enough. <laughs> uh, I, I'm actually kind of liking this game. The more I get into it, I'm kind of liking it. I think I'm just liking the story presence of it. That's sort of sucking me in because I'm like, I want to know more. <laughs> Can I? Oh, I can. Cool. Brings me nowhere, though. But I did it. <laughs> I did it. But yeah, it takes place after Super Metroid. Uh, there is a parasite that took her suit. And it's sort of like a horror movie at the moment because there's just these, this is this, this parasite walking around in a Samus suit that has every single one of your abilities ever. And you're stuck with this like fusion looking suit, as you can say. And sometimes when you're walking around, you might run into yourself. 
And in that case, either you need to hide or you need to run if you're caught. And it is terrifying. We like a platformer with a good story. It's actually no. I mean, it's. I mean, it's not like amazing, but it's like it's solid. It's kind of like what you wanted from Mother M. <laughs> like someone of a story with this type of gameplay. So Mother M. Just threw it all away. Ow. I can actually definitely see the connections between us and other M though. I will say that. Okay, I'm almost at where I need to be. Just want to grab the missiles. <laughs> But no, it's actually a really good, I feel like the concept of it is actually kind of cool. All right, so I can go through here and there. There we go. I will say again, the upgrades and everything, it's a little, they are like, it's kind of easy compared to Super Metroid, but I'm still liking it. GG's, thank you. Right, I'm not too worried about health. So I saw that door is there. Which means we might be fighting something. Once we get down there. Also, this is like a whole maze. I was trying to get through anywhere. It's gonna be at the end too, am I kidding? Nope. <laughs> I lied to myself, it's right here. Oh good. I'm working on prototyping art while I watch. Ooh. What do you have so far? So like the Pachiritsu? Like that type of art? It's like Aspirate, what's it called? Aspirate. All right, will you, thank you. <laughs> like, will you just I? I don't know if there's a save point, so you know what? No, don't reset the game. I'm making, I'm making my own restore point. I don't care. Playing it safe. Oh, this isn't good. Oh. Was that what I saw before? Oh, shoot. Oh, hand drawn at the moment. I might actually switch over to. Oh, okay. How do I... I am so confused. Oh, 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 okay, I think I should get it. Wait. No, not like this, not like this. Get off me. <laughs> I think, I think I know what to do. We just got an upgrade. Come at me. My grabbing. Uh, it didn't work. Never mind. Never mind. It didn't work. It didn't work. How do I hurt you? Maybe it's his butt? So I can't hurt it in the mouth. Seriously. Alright, we're gonna restart because I'm gonna die. Oh my kidding. I am glad actually I made a restore point there. <laughs> this is just... I'm just trying to understand how to hurt this thing. The only thing I can think of is like use morph balls. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Never mind, figure that out. It's called dodging and there we go. Call it names. Oh, also, does anyone have a spider phobia? I right, should probably show back. Ow. 
That actually works. Uh, come over here, Pip Squeak. Yeah, you got nothing on me, yo, you. Oh, shoot. <laughs> it's gonna kill me. Jeez. Alright, I understand the pattern a little. Alright. Thanks, fire. Ow. Alright, I'm gonna restart it one more time. I think I know what to do now. That was just confusing. <laughs> All right, you little six legs, you. Think you might have eight? Shoot. I'm like, I'm already losing. <laughs> I was waiting for it to stop. So as long as you're in the corner, it doesn't really... Oh, crap. I missed everything. <laughs> Dang it. But how has your day been? Been that much up in anything? comfortable in this chair. <laughs> right, I feel like every single... time that happens. Alright, it's getting into different color phase. Not a bad day, insanely busy at work, but pretty quiet evening. Okay. I was changed. I wonder if maybe I'll get like spider ball if I beat this thing. Just thought about that. <laughs> it's a spider. How about you? Mostly worked. Uh, it's been very quiet. I'm afraid to move. But not. I've had a good day. Dang it. Get out of there. I feel like the corner strategy works if I stay in the right corner at the right time. Like here, I think should be fine. Like as long as it just doesn't grab me, that's all. I'm, that's all I can ask. I get it. Nope. Now you're just a spinning head. Cool. This is ridiculous. <laughs> All right. I mean, we got to the end. Hopefully. So we'll be fine. No, I had a good day. Let's, uh, let's just, let's just chill. Oh, jeez. This one's a bit tricky, though. Music is bopping. Alright, there's definitely someone of uh I fucked it up. No, I didn't. I was like, I feel like there's definitely someone of a pattern. I actually might put the art on pause, I should go back to story planning instead. Okay. It's like science fiction and stuff like that, right?
I just want to throw like every single missile I have at it. <laughs> okay, get it. <laughs> right, there we go. Making a lot better progress than last time. I'm just gonna shoot missiles and just hope for the best. I Man, I guess I could technically just this would be better. Actually, that's probably way better. Take it back. <laughs> Jesus. This face is ridiculous. Alright, you know what? This is doing better. God, it's not dead. I'm gonna die. All right, this boss is tough because <laughs> it has like 15 million phases. <laughs> I was just about to clap. Me too. <laughs> that was the last phase for sure. Because every single time you finish a boss off, it always ends with. That like parasite looking phase. <laughs> I don't think I got a pattern going. <laughs> I'm just going on the wrong side of the walls. All right, so maybe I should just start over here. There we go. Ah, oh, crap. I'm already doing worse. Problem with this phase is like once it drops you. Like you're in trouble. I'm like, all right, I'm restarting. I hate this chair. Cannot get comfortable for the life of me. This damn thing. And yes, I am blaming the chair. <laughs> Let me have my blame thing. But I am also very uncomfortable in this chair. <laughs> Care if I take damage there at this point, I just want to like, go into an area. What well, chair with a jerk? It really, I'm um, actually being completely honest, it is very uncomfortable. Like when I first had this chair, it felt actually really nice. It's not as nice as I remember it being. I'm stuck in the corner again. I just want to kill it. <laughs> That's all I want to do at this point. I just want to kill this thing. Also doing so bad. Like, I'm just so afraid to move. But the thing is, I start shooting fast. Yeah, man. So I was like, I think it's going to start shooting faster. If I can get through this phase without being like close to death, I might have a chance. It's 
That'd be extremely close. Like, extremely, extremely close. Fuck! <laughs> this boss is hard! <laughs> I'm just happy I made that save point. <laughs> oh, for crying out loud, I messed up. <sighs> I'm getting frustrated. I want to restart. All right, how can I? I worked. I don't care how many missiles I got shoot in its mouth, I just want to shoot everything I can. If I can just get to the second phase being like half health, that would be nice. I did notice there is a little part there where if you're in the right position, you could actually get the side of its mouth and just shoot. I think I might be caught. Yeah, that was, I messed up. Yeah, I should be fine here. All right, so we got to this phase, good. It's not even funny how much, like, I want to use my missiles here because I feel like it's going to do more damage. But I feel like it's more of a hazard. Just save it for the end. Alright, we're, we're definitely doing better than last time, I'll say that. I think when we got to the end, I think we had like half, not even like 99 health left. Alright, I do need to heal a little. Alright, like one more, two more. Alright, we should be fine now. There we go. That was frustrating though. Space jump ability recovered, somersault continually in the air. Thank you. I was trying to say whether or not we we're gonna get a space, like, I didn't even think space jump. I think it's spider ball. All right, so I can just. That's already nicer than Super Metroid. Good job, thank you. It only took me like 15 tries. That was a really hard boss battle. Like, honestly. All right, so we got the auxiliary power back on. Cool. I've set a rough goal of waiting to have my first game out by 2023. I honestly, that's not, that's not a bad goal. Like give me like a year and a half, I think at this point, maybe two years. Do you have like a storyboard maybe you can make out? And be like, all right, I want to get all these things done by these certain deadlines. All right. Save rooms and recharge rooms are now back online, but with only auxiliary power, no elevators or hatches will work. Without the main silo online, we're stuck. I believe the source of the problem is the vegetation. You saw earlier choking the reactor core components. This is your objective clear? No. We'll have to find the source of those roots to proceed. Okay. to find the source of the roots it's not that clear i plan to map it all out like that but i don't have it yet okay oh these roots like 
sitting here. I'm like, what roots are you talking about? I don't even want to climb anything anymore. I can just jump to infinity. Ow. <laughs> Alright, I'm not perfect yet. I still need to get a screw attack, but it's something. Whee. So let's call by the roots. There is a door all the way at the bottom. I didn't even see that. Hold up. So busy jumping, I'm not realizing there's a door there. I really think it's going to be my primary hang up. Okay. I think this looks breakable. Alright, so we're trying to figure out these roots. And why I need the. Oh, wait, what's this? Yeah, that's a thing. Let's see where this brings me, whether it's something new or just like a secret item or something. No, this is definitely something. So we all the way back to sector two. Oh. Oh no. You don't see me. Shit, 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 shit. I didn't realize. I did not realize. I'm dead. <laughs> Uh, by the way, I'm walking around. Fucking Sam is just standing there at the edge of the door. Great, thanks. Yeah, I gotta do it this way. <laughs> so it's called. They call it SAX in this game. Um, but there's a parasite walking around Samus's suit, and if you're not careful, that's what's gonna happen. <laughs> so the good news is, I do feel that I did find the right way to go, considering. <laughs> Um, bad news. Uh, I ran into Samus. <laughs> I ran. I ran into my suit. My suit will destroy me. Because <laughs> it's facing no matter how many good upgrades I get in this game, it's nothing compared to the Varya suit. Like you thought, Dark Samus was bad. Try taking something on that has your armor. <laughs> All right, so I need to figure out how to get through here. Because first of all, I wasn't even thinking about the music. You'll never get me. <laughs> I don't understand how to get through here, though. If I'm supposed to get through here, unless I can jump up that way. Let's just 
try again. Okay, because where am I supposed to go from there? I don't get that. Unless I'm not supposed to go here. But I feel like I'm supposed to. Also, well, just very uncomfortable. <laughs> like, there's gotta be something else. I don't know why I'm still trying to go this way. <laughs> Thinking like, yeah, this is probably the way I need to go. But maybe it is. <laughs> and maybe I'm missing something. It doesn't feel like it is at the same time. I would like to get out of here. That's why I would like to do. I'm just trying to think like if I go into a fight. Alright, here's what I'm gonna do. I will make a restore point again, just so I don't have to save and go all the way back. Um I already messed it up. There he, there he got Samus to come after me. Fight you though. Cool. I can't. Yeah, that's a good point. Can I fight you? No. No, I can't. <laughs> How are my beams so weak? <laughs> Maybe Samus was, SAX will just eventually disappear. Or I could jump up there. I think SAX knew I was there. Jokes on them. Can I jump through here? No. <laughs> I'm just curious. I'm like, can I? Can I? Why are you so strong? I just want to live long enough just to say, oh, I can blow that up. It's possible. <laughs> so maybe I can't get through. Excuse me. It's like, blow that up. Run. Just run. Get through the door. so fast yep leave <sighs> so this is what we learned today <laughs> we cannot fight ourselves Hey, we go up there though. <laughs> it's just like it's terrifying. I don't you know if I was supposed to do that? <laughs> Can't go to the right, so I guess we're going here. 
That was the toughest encounter I've had with uh, SAX so far. That really, uh, that was, that was, I'm creating a store point just in case. But that was actually truly terrifying. <laughs> I've never had it where SAX chased me that far. Which, that's what they call it, by the way. It's SAX. The X stands for Parasite. You know, obviously, I think, decide on what the SA stands for. <laughs> and not an SA. I can go that way. Whoops. What's that? Oh, death. It's death. Please save me, bomb. <laughs> of course, axe is for parasite. <laughs> oh, for crying out loud. All right, let's go. You need to get to that save station. That'd be nice. Not even that. I would like to get to. So where the heal? Thank you. You don't get enough health in this game. <laughs> you really don't. Like at some points, I feel like I do, and then I run into like one thing. It takes like my entire like everything health wise. Uh, I guess I could not take that way or that way. Is the game sort of leading you where you need to go? I wonder if I'm supposed to be over here. If I'm over here, I should have a reason to be over here. For example, I can actually jump up here now. I can jump over there before. Actually, I kind of want to check out these areas. Maybe I can... I have a feeling maybe I need like a screw attack. We haven't gotten up that great upgrade yet, but I've seen a couple pillars now where I know for sure we will eventually get it. <laughs> So that's why at this point I'm like, I'm just waiting to get the screw attack. <laughs> screw attack's the move where you're like, you're still jumping on the space suit, but it's just, you do damage as you jump. Which, uh, can't do that yet, we can only jump. Oh, shit. Really? <laughs> I have no health. That's my other problem right now. I walk into an area, I'm gonna die in one hit. Jeez, I, I don't have time to kill these things. No, not in this game. That's only in uh, the pri oh, fuck. It's only in the prime games. Prime games, you get health for saving. This game, you get, uh... You get terrified. Oh, come on! <laughs> I feel like I hit it. <laughs> I mean, I guess I'm here. Can't get like anywhere before I'm getting hit. <laughs> Can't go up here. Guess that's good to know. I think I do have to go this way. 
kind of getting to the point where I'm like, I just want to kind of want to farm them. I keep going in and out of this room to get health. Oh, don't you run. And then the other one's going to come after me. But I also want to go up here because I'm like, what's up here? Oh. Now I'm worth it. <laughs> I mean, I guess I got health for it, but. Oh, that's not good. Oh, that's actually really good. This is health. Thank you. But what's in here? Ow. Ow, ow, ow. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Are you for real? <laughs> Get out. <laughs> I'm just gonna die. The fuck was that? <laughs> Alright, that was actually kind of. <laughs> Alright, that was kind of bullshit. <laughs> Is it the moment you fall in, you fall right on top of the plane and you're dead? If you can't jump out. Spent all that time getting health. That's frustrating. I was waiting for more of those things to pop out. Come on, where are you at? All right, so I really did have to go up that way. Whatever that, um, baddie's gonna be. No, I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna bother. Cool, I need to go on the other side. So you have to wait, you have to wait for that. <laughs> you have to wait for the eye to show up. Then you can do that. All right, in case of total BS happens again, we'll make a restore point. But that's just... Like, you get sucked in. And then you can't get out, and I'm very confused. And it's like so slippery. Like, I can't get out. I don't, I don't get it. I don't, I don't get it. This is like, other brain annoying, <laughs> or worse. Because once you're in there, like, you cannot get out. Or maybe you can? That's weird. The problem is, like, you're getting sucked in. And you have to, like, hold A and just, like, fly out somehow. Let me just start out by saying somehow. All right, did that. Yeah, this is actually very similar to Mother Brain. I just don't get what we gotta destroy the statue. I don't care, I'm just going all out. Well, that's better. 
This is confusing. <laughs> also, the difficulty just like spiked. I feel like since like the last boss. Can I destroy those things? I'm just curious. No, they're just annoying. Like you can chew them, but it's... It's almost dead. This is a weird boss. Alright, we got it. Oh shoot. <laughs> I'm like, I'm not gonna live from this. Oh, there's some room. Maybe I can. Nope. <laughs> I do feel like the difficulty just like Spiked. If I can just get past like this phase, I feel like I'm gonna be fine. I'm also just like wasting all the missiles. <laughs> Alright. Well, I mean, at least I'm doing damage on this thing now, but it's just not much. And it's like the moment to see you. My goodness. Alright, what do we get? Plasma beam ability recovered. The beam now pierces enemies. Okay. Oh, yeah. That was tough. All right, see what a new beam does. Oh. It's kind of like Samus Returns now, huh? Like a little bit. Nice. All right, I need to get out of here. So does my beam... Source of the plant roots tree that plasma beam ability absorbed. Okay. Oh, wow. This actually does do a lot of damage. <laughs> Just trying it out now, that's why I'm like, oh my God. Get all these guys in like a couple hits now. Now I'm like looking for like <laughs> SAX. <laughs> I'm like, oh, chase me now. See what happens. I might have the weapon that I need to finally conquer him. No, seriously, where where do I need to go now? Do the roots? Oh, I can probably turn the reactor on now. I just gotta figure out how to get out. I can get through those doors now. That's good. It's kind of weird to be in an empty room in here. Really? Nothing? All right. It was just like a healing room. <laughs> Go in there, kill a bunch of enemies, leave. I was just expecting way more. 
I do also feel like they're giving me just a room to sell all my new weapons. And I, I appreciate it. <laughs> so I enjoy it very much right now. Um, okay. So the planet roots are taken care of. Let's... Actually, we're done with Sector 2 now. Just realize. Or most of Sector 2. Everyone the right. Kind of want to go back. <laughs> Let's go back. If I can. So I want to check what's in that room. Nope, I can't. All right, cool. Yeah, I think I had to take the long way back. Never mind. Now I remember. Yeah, let's get back to the let's get the healing. Healing and saving and then figure out where to go. I might just need to go back to the restore reactor room. Reactor room. And maybe I'll be good after that. Sorry, I know I was frustrated on my part. So I apologize. All right. What? Well, you restored plasma beam functionality. Most well, unexpected. Even so, continue to avoid SAX. It too may be stronger. And you still lack a few abilities crucial to survival. Wait, wait a second. More trouble. Hold on. Great. <laughs> I have isolated the cause. There's been an explosion in the ARC data room. And five again? Same as go to sector five. Is your objective clear? Yeah. Here we gotta figure out what's causing it. It's like one thing after another. <laughs> it's like what could be causing this explosion? <laughs> Is that five? Yeah, five. It's always five. I feel like it's been five lately. <laughs> Seriously, this is... <laughs> yeah. There, right, what's going on? It's a five, right? It's gotten worse. The damage seems to have been caused. A certain creature kept here by the researchers who named it the Nightmare. I can't get comfortable. I'm so sorry. It was a biomechanical organism designed for military applications. It's probably the thing that's been flying around. It possesses uncommon power and can manipulate gravity. We must assume that it's become an ex-host. We have no choice. You must find it and defeat it. I can't confirm the location. <laughs> is it clear? Yeah. This thing is out of control her before it destroys the entire station. That's the best part. This thing is massive. It is extremely dangerous. I don't know where it is. Is your objective clear? Kill it. <laughs> Good luck. Godspeed. Uh, well, back here. Good to be back. I think I know where it is. I think it's in here. Or this is where it broke out. Sorry. Figured it was in here. Uh, nah, it could be anywhere then. Or it is a nightmare. It's on a rampage. Find it and engage. So it might not even be here. Per se, right? Like it could be if the door broke there. I just realized. <laughs> All right, we're in a new area. It's gotta be somewhere in here. 
If the destruction's this bad, it has to be. Alright, so it's down. <laughs> Mike, I kind of figured that might be overkill, but it's fine. I don't know. It's like a fishy space pirate. Probably the one thing I hate about being in the water right now. A, not having the suit to go through here. I think I just realized what we're about to get. <laughs> so I would love to be able to travel through here and I just can't. <laughs> Yeah, there's no way I'm going up there. Well, actually, maybe. Yeah, we'll give it a try. Just very slow. Yeah. <laughs> it's like going so slow through the water is my problem. Yeah, well, that's two. Yeah, I'm like, I want the far one at the end. <laughs> I give me the red upgrade. There we go. It's in here, maybe? It's somewhere hidden. Let's be real. At first, if you don't succeed, pull everything up. There we go. <laughs> I'm saying, if you don't succeed, just pull it up. You'll be fine. Just keep going right. I actually do kind of like it went from I'm telling you exactly where to go, like holding your hand, to I don't know where anything is. Just look around. <laughs> Maybe you'll find something. Because now this, this feels like, you know, older Metro games. Like the ones I most recently played, like they give you an idea of what you need to do, but they don't tell you. They're just like, actually, they don't even tell you anything. <laughs> you just kind of just have to figure it out on your own based on the gameplay mechanics of the story. This one at this point is like it's still a story, but they're just like, yeah, we don't know. It's somewhere in this area. Just look around, you'll find something. <laughs> Which to the extent it's still easy to find where you need to go it's just not it's not that bad can i jump up here okay i can i think we're about to find another boss well like a boss spree it's definitely going to be in here you would assume after our save station not sure if i trust that energy tank we'll go for it <laughs> yep, I think we found it. Whoa. Hello. So you're Nightmare? Oh, that's like a little hole there. All right, I see it. Can I get under you? I'm just trying to figure out how to damage this thing. All right, missiles work. Oh, that's not good. Oh, it does control gravity. And you can't shoot missiles at it. Holy crap. I have to use power beam. Yeah, power beams work. All right, well, I'm going to die. That's fine. Did 
least we're learning. Ew. Just say, how do I attack you? I was, what the hell was that? <laughs> Alright, I am curious. Can I get the energy tank before falling? Because if I can, that'd be awesome. Otherwise, eh. <laughs> Alright, so I can't go that way. I have to go up. Oh, well, for shot. I'm like, nice. <laughs> All right. I'm going to go ahead and do this again. Let me give it a try. See if we can actually uh, go over there. Tried. <laughs> he tried. All right, so this thing. So it comes up. Can I actually... Can I get... Yeah, like here in the beginning of the fight? I'm looking at the thing, I'm like, I think I would like to. I think I have an idea how to beat it. If I'm not reckless. So you definitely have to use charged up plasma beam shots. All right, well, I'm here, so I might as well just go all out. All right, this is the part where I'm just like, okay, I don't know what to do here. Maybe power up. No, don't. I don't know. I figure you gotta shoot the face. All right, you do have to shoot the face. I was not working before. Alright, at least I know what to shoot. I'm just curious why it didn't work before when I was trying it. That's that's a little odd. Oh, it worked! Alright, cool. So we got an energy tank. Let's save again. <laughs> I've never used a restore point so much for a Wii U game. That's actually kind of cool. All right, let's do this again. We got this. I feel like you're shooting in his stomach. It's just going wow. Wow, it's the wow boss. Shoot it. No. Just gotta trap me in the corner. Just wow. That's all I got. It's just wow. It's really. It's so weird. I'm not gonna feel high. This doesn't feel like a Metroid boss. I don't even know what this feels like. Also, it's tough. I do feel like I'm getting close to killing it. It's just. Wow. <laughs> Alright, try this again. I thought this was like some type of Mantine looking thing. This is not even close. <laughs> Who I thought it was gonna be. I'm like, I'm looking at this now, I'm like, this face really isn't that bad. If I can just. I 
figure out how the, I was gonna say, figure out how to dodge this phase. That'll be fine. It's just wow. <laughs> this is my problem. It's like you can't get close to its face because it's like one little spot where you can hit it at. And it's like when you finally get close. You have like maybe like one or two shots tops on it. It's getting very tricky. It's just because we're here. Sorry. Just the wow. Wow. Right, I'm not doing too good this time. Wow. Can I shoot a missile? Yeah. I'd rather do that. But still, like this part, I don't understand. How are you supposed to dodge it? Like you can't. I mean, you can, I guess, but it's really annoying. I honestly, I have to be honest, I really do feel like I need a new chair. <laughs> so I'm just, I'm just sliding. I'm sliding. Like, I'm not even trying to slide. I'm just sliding. I know I've been complaining about it. I'm sorry. I'm just sliding. Same. I want one of those, like, uh, I don't care. I'll go off for a chair. As long as I'm comfortable. The thing is, I haven't had this chair for this long. I've only had maybe two, three years tops. I think more like two. All right, I'm gonna try to attack faster with the missiles. I think the goal is just kill it as fast as you can. <laughs> I'm sure right in the wild. Like this part, I don't get. Like, why would it just be stuck against a wall? Like the one spot where you can shoot it at, and it's not allowing you to shoot it. Like that makes no sense to me. That's so close. I don't get that. I think that's dumb. But I don't. I don't get that. I want a chair that is perfectly built for me, but also less than a hundred dollars. Let me know where you can find that and if you can actually build it yourself. So if we can DIY that, I would totally be down. Maybe power bombs? Wow. I feel like that would take too much time though. So this phase, you can't really do much of anything other than shoot the little cannon in the stomach. All right, so it's done. Like this, like this, this is, that does not make sense. To be a thing there.
Like, wow. Like, can I just... Oh, I should get to see this. Ah, uh, okay. Wow. <laughs> Literally wow there. <laughs> Alright, that works. Alright, well, for me, if I die, I'm gonna die. Alright, that would be him. <laughs> this might be kind of cheap, but it'll work. It's not even cheap, it's part of the game. It's fine. It's like, how is it cheap if it's part of the game? Like, part of the mechanic. A lot of wow is happening here. Wow. I think we'll get it this time. Hopefully. So I still feel like we got to go into like a parasite form. Which means I still have wow a lot more to do. So at this point, it's just like missile spam away. Yeah, we're doing a lot better. Wow. I am just, I'm just going all out. I don't care if I have to drop the frames per second. Wow. Yep, here we go. Parasite form. So this should give me, I think I'm getting a new suit. And if it's great, it's gonna look sweet. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. It's kept, they kept talking about gravity, so I'm assuming gravity suit. Yeah. Gravity suit effect recovered. Move freely in water. Love it. And hopefully lava. I guess it's more a maximum of two wows. Alright, let's take a guess. What color are we turning, changing into? I mean, I think gray. Also, the parasite look gray. So I'm thinking the suit's gotta look gray. We're getting out of this lime green, thank goodness. But I'm curious what this next color's gonna be. We started out with blue. It was green. I think it's gonna be gray. That's my guess. Maybe like a gray with like, I don't know, purple. Well, I guess we're about to find out. <laughs> Brown? All right. Oh, that's purple. Okay, I do like this one better than the other one. <laughs> Looks like I was right. Yeah, this is definitely nicer than... Uh, the green's like on the inside now. Also, I got something in my eye. But the green's on the inside and the suit's purple. I like that. All right, we did grab that energy tank. What was I looking for? Wait. <laughs> Gravity suit absorbed, proceed to navigation room. All right, I guess that's all, that's all I was looking for. So I can move freely through water now without issues. I'm almost full power. Are you on the Wii U? I am. I gotta run. Right. Yeah, I'm, uh, I'm playing through the Wii U version. I want a Wii solely for Nintendo Land. I forgot about that game. Do I still have it? I think I do. I look up and I have like a collection of Wii U games and I literally already have them on my Switch. So... It's like I have them, but it's like, eh, it's not really have them. It's like, you have them, but. It's like, you more like already have them ported. <laughs> I think the only ones based on the games I have. I like Bayonetta 2, I never got the Switch version, even though I kind of wanted it. Because it came with the first Bayonetta, and I kind of wanted to play them both again. But I never ended up getting it. And then, you know, Bayonetta 3 would be how it's, you know, probably next console generation who would be kidding at this rate. But the thing is, like, that and Xenoblade Chronicles X. It's, like, the only two Wii U games I think I'm looking at where I'm like, 
I think I have the. These are like the only games I don't have on my Switch. <laughs> they are the um. Then, then like Wind Waker and Twilight Princess HD. That's like it. All right. What I want to do? I want to get to the navigation room, and then save. See what they say and then take a quick break because I have to take my dog out in a couple minutes or technically now. <laughs> Can I break this? No. All right. I can break that. Like, how can I? Walk? <laughs> oh, hell yeah. I want this. Get me up there, please. I right, jump through that. I probably was not supposed to do that. <laughs> All right, but I do think I know what I need to do. I was trying to figure out that was there. <laughs> that last one's tricky. I'm over here just like, I'm just gonna climb through them all. Did I just do that? Oh, okay. <laughs> I didn't even need the morph ball. I could just walk up to it. Uh, I was looking at getting some Wii games, but I didn't expect them to be so cheap. Oh, really? Like which ones? They were able to find cheap. So I remember at the time, like near the end of the weed life cycle, they had like all those uh, Operation Raindrop games, I think they were called. Rainfall, for what it's called. But they're like a bunch of JRPGs. I ended up getting them all, but I haven't played them. <laughs> really? Like I've done. Uh, Need to play Chronicles on the Wii. I thought was about it. They had like the last story and what was the other one? I have it. Pandora's Tower. So how are you supposed to get up there? <laughs> like I wanted those. I cannot get comfortable. <laughs> I might just take my beer me now just so I can get comfortable. Might be the pants too. And the pants are making me slip out of this chair. This is a very slippery chair. <laughs> uh, the main hitters, mild galaxies, Metroid Prime 3. What the hell else was there? I don't remember. There was like $10 each. I remember I think I had like the No More Hero games on there too. Those were actually really fun. I am excited for the new one. No More Heroes 3. That's probably one of my top Switch games for this year. Quack. Alright, can I actually go through here? This is why I need to know. Oh, I just want to get through. How do I get out of here? No More Heroes is not my style. Understandable. Yeah, that's a, it's a, it's an interesting game. <laughs> yeah, I, I can understand if people not liking it. How the fuck do I get out of here? Seriously? And go right. All right. There's a path I have not taken. <gasps> I'm so sorry. Excuse me. I don't know. I think I just like the over top ridiculousness of that game sometimes. I got food? Hell yeah. I I beat the boss. I gotta run through here. I I, I beat the boss. 
And we got a new suit. And now I can walk through water. A three crackers. Hell yeah. Oh my goodness, come on. I'm just trying to run through here and just, enemies just pop up everywhere. That's a lot of food though. That's a lot of crackers. Whoa. Where am I? <laughs> Hold up. Actually, there's something down here. I'll take it. Let's blow it up. Power bomb. Oh, I can't get it yet. All right. Pretty sure I do know when I need to get it, but I don't have it. I need a lot of running to do here. Or I have a lot of running I need to do here. Eh, birds. <laughs> oh, lovely. That's the worst part when killing enemies and then suddenly they're like, you haven't even seen my true form. Cool. Not cool. Did I not blow all of them up? All right, let's try this again. There we go. I'm like looking at this thing and I'm like, how did I not jump through that? This is new. Now, where am I? Wait. I'm supposed to go to the navigation room, right? I haven't even been able to get the one. I'm just gonna explore. All right, I am actually gonna take a quick BRB. I need to take my dog out. Uh, when I get back, we'll play more. I don't think we're finishing this tonight. <laughs> I think we'll get close, maybe. I think maybe I'll have like another hour or two left after I get through or whatever. So I don't think we have that much more left based on where I'm at. I might only have, I don't know. Depends on how much we get done tonight. Um, but feel free to stretch. Get food. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll be back in like 10 minutes-ish. But sit tight. Thank you for honestly dealing with my screaming and frustrations today. <laughs> I have been doing that a lot. Um, yeah. About it. Maybe I would need to get the Lola. All right. I just looked at my chair and I had like this biggest indentation of like where the cushion is, and then it's just like flat. <laughs> it was horrible. Also, I did unbutton my buttons. I feel unbuttoned now. I feel like I need to do it. <laughs> I feel free, but she's doing well. I had to carry her downstairs. It was great. <laughs> She is, well now she's kind of awake now, but the pup was out cold and I can tell you she did not want to go out, <laughs> but I hope everyone had a good break. Yeah, I think we're going to go like another half hour-ish or so and then we'll probably wrap there. Uh, let's see. <coughs> also, like, I didn't realize that my seat was, like, so far back from all well, that sliding. I'm like, I didn't realize how far out my microphone was. Uh, okay, yeah. I feel like I need to freeze a lot of these enemies. I also just feel like every single time I get, like, a new weapon... It almost becomes useless, but it's helpful against these enemies, which is good. I do wonder if it's possible to actually beat up SAX without any of your abilities. Like, I really do wonder if that's a thing, and if so, that would be actually really cool. I want to find out about that afterwards. Maybe people somehow find some type of way to 
loop it and use like regular attacks to actually finish off SAX. There's gotta be a way. Probably just break the game entirely, but it must work. So I can go left and right. Let's go left. Left leads to a dead end. So I'm, I'm just going to assume this must have stuff. Yeah, it does. Because I can't get in. I, we are actually looking for a navigation room though. So I might try to get into the one here. So I might not be able to... Uh, Go further into the plot without finding one. What is that? Alright. You can just die. There we go. Close. Very close. If I need to like jump left and then right, if I can. Like, start my way going right and then go up. I want to go up. <laughs> it's the only way I can go, right? Yeah. <laughs> Don't know why I'm doing this. There we go. Oh, I can't go that way anyway, so I'm stuck here. I think I progressed to an area I was not supposed to go to yet. Like I had to take a different path and said I took a completely different turn. Can't go either way. All right, let's go. So you can't go that way. Can't go that way. Let's just go back. There's no other ways to go. Are these fish hunters. <laughs> Guess that's what they're called. Mermaid space hunters. Not my favorites. Also, is this breakable? No. All right. <laughs> Add a no. All right, so we're very safe there. Let's just go back. So I don't think I can go back. So let's go forward. <laughs> I locked, wait. That's before the boss. No, I can't go left. So there's no red door there, but there was a red door there. Oh, 
Oh, of course. I think go out this way. Yeah, I can't go this way. There's a door. Can I? Okay, I'll blow this up. <laughs> I can. Don't know where it's gonna take me. I can blow it up. Looking around, I'm like, I'm gonna kill this thing. Honestly, at this point, sometimes I wonder if killing the enemies are actually just a waste of time. Just because I feel like the amount of damage I take from them doesn't equal how much I uh, <laughs> actually heal. Why is your work shirt still on? I don't feel like taking it off right now, man. All right. <laughs> Take the buttons off. Really? Hey, every single time I'm thinking, I'm like, okay, I've, I've, I got, I made progress. I'm getting somewhere. He has had an opportunity. I'm not ready to do it. <laughs> the problem is the moment I take my work shirt off, I'm just going, I'm just getting ready for bed. That's, that's all I'm doing with it. <laughs> oh, what's this? All right, killed everyone there. I get in here? I can. Okay. Mm, bed sounds nice. It does. But yeah, I'm like, I didn't feel like changing into anything just because, like, I got home and, like, got home around, I don't know, like, five hours ago, if I'm being honest. I've been streaming probably for three and a half of it. So, I mean, I did have a two-hour window to change. I just didn't want to. <laughs> so I'm just like, I'm just going to change into a shirt and barely wear it. And then it's going to be more laundry. But what if I just, you know, not do that? <laughs> What's in here? Nothing? I'm tempted to pull my TV into my room so I can lay in bed and work remote. Work remote, remote as in wake up and play Switch all day. <laughs> That's going to be kind of like my goal tomorrow. When I work in the office, I make sure I do as much work as I possibly can while I'm in there. Just when I have my remote days coming up, I can sort of have some freedom to do some stuff when I'm, uh, when I'm here. Working. So it's not as much. Like, I still work, obviously. But I don't have to do it too, too much. It's not as stressful. Which is nice. I'm too efficient. <laughs> I feel like whenever I'm not at work, not much work is done. And then when I'm at work, I didn't phrase that correctly. When I'm not working, period, I feel like our work gets backed up. And then I just want to make sure when I'm there, I got everything I can done. <laughs> that way, when I do have to work from home, I can just work from home and then where the hell am I supposed to go? <laughs> like, I'm confused. Dude. I don't know where your car is. Seriously, where? 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 I don't even go what this is supposed to be for. I feel like I should be able to break this. Or at least roll into something. I 
and the same seem some people on a job question if people work unsupervised i'm like dog my incentive to get my work done on time is not having to deal with the shit storm if i wait exactly which in my case i feel like a lot of people do wait um But today I did what like I did a lot today, but I didn't want to overdo it. <laughs> but I did do a lot today. We basically have like no work left to do. I don't know where to go. Like, there's nowhere to go here. Like I've looked in here, there's nothing. There's a door there I can't get into. I'm sitting here wondering, like, do I have to get in here somehow? <laughs> and if so, how? Even better yet, do I have to go down here? Like, is this breakable? It is. Don't know where left's gonna take me, but. Maybe it won't take me anywhere. <laughs> this is a dead end. Thanks. Maybe I have to go take the left path. Like over there. This is a really strange level. Actual fact, 9% of my coworkers shop on Amazon all day and save a month's worth of work until the last day. Yeah, I'm not surprised by that at all. I have one coworker who literally just sits there and turns in his chair all day, not really doing much of anything. Until, uh... I was going to say, why did the music stop? Until he has to start working. <laughs> Like I'm staring at the guy and he's just like spinning in his chair. I'm just looking at him like At the time I just wanted to just be like, dude, there's like a lot of work that we have to get done here. Other times I'm like, you know what? That's on you. <laughs> That's your problem. They know how much work you're getting done. <clears throat> I don't know where to go. A lot of times I just like focus on myself. Even though it does make me lose my mind, just because I'm like, if I took like a week off, I'm just imagining how many emails we would be back up on. <laughs> so I have not taken a week off, or I haven't used any like paid time off yet since I've been at my new job. I haven't even taken a day off at my new job. Oh, sorry, excuse me. Um, the only days I've ever been in the office is when they just randomly give it to me. <laughs> or they're just like, okay, it's like a holiday thing. You have to take some time off or something like that. Like, then I'll take a time off or day off or, you know, whatever. Oh, wait a minute. There we go. That's so confusing. So, like, days like that, I'll take off, but nothing else. If I'm not on the clock, I'm not looking at my email. Exactly. If I'm on the clock, I'm working. Not on my phone, not on anything else, just working. But the guy next to me was really just uh, on his work computer, <laughs> just throw on Twitch as like a pop up. Not even listening to it, he's just watching Twitch as he's working. That's why I'm just like, dude, come on. <laughs> I would love to do that too, but come on. Now, while you're at work, at home's a whole other story. At work, come on. <laughs> and then they start questioning why there's more work being done at home 
or at the office compared to at home and it's like well there's here's your answer <laughs> All right, one sec. Excuse me, sorry. Um, yeah, we've I've, we've already started running into that issue. They're like looking at us. Like my bosses are essentially looking at us and being like, "Listen, we can see there's more work being done in the office," and. We're trying to give you an incentive to figure out some way to actually start working more at home and you're not helping your case just because more work is being done in the office. Like if that's going to happen, you're not going to work from home. Simple as that. Which to me, I'm really not bothered by it. Like they still give us days to work from home. Like even if it's only like a half a day, which is I don't mind. But still, like they they're they're giving us the opportunity, and we're kind of biting it. <laughs> I think the way I'm looking at it, I definitely get less work done in the office. I'm like even. I think I get like slightly more work done in, in the office, but it's not that much more. It's like very little more. I think everyone else is like significantly different, <laughs> based on our meeting we had last week. Just curious if I can get that. No, I can't. All right, never mind. I'm crying out loud. Seriously, killing these enemies are just not worth it in this game. You just don't heal enough. Like you heal just not much. Yeah, for me, it's like. I think I get just a little bit more done at home. Not much more. <clears throat> but not at home, in the office. But not, it's not like significantly different. But I'm pretty sure they know. And they, they get an idea how many emails that we get done and what we're getting done every single day. And they're seeing the differences in totals. Like they're, they know. I think after the meeting, some of them are starting to finally realize that, but at the same time, it's like, uh, <laughs> might be too little too late at this point. <laughs> too many distractions in the office and no natural light. Not about that light. <laughs> and no natural light. <laughs> yeah, I feel that. I'm surprised you have more distractions in the office than at home, if I'm being honest. Like, what distractions do you have when you're in the office? If we don't mind asking, you don't have to answer. Can I break this? No. Had to know. I can blow it up. Nope. <laughs> oh, okay. I can do that, though. Wait, can I just, like, shoot this little body? Alright. Don't clip. Oh, wait. Yeah, I can get by. Easy. Maybe. <laughs> no. <laughs> Just people. Gotcha. <clears throat> so if I jump up, can't get that way. All right. I feel like I'm almost back to where I need to be.
Also dying for health. Uh, small things add up. Okay. Uh, welcome by talking nightly, pestering me to lie on the refrigerators. I gotcha. How? Seriously, how can I get by you? It's gotta be some way. I blow you up? No. Alright, there's another path I can take, maybe. I gotta be careful not to get myself killed. Oh, I could run. Wait, hold up. Go back. I start running. Not soon enough. Yeah, to me, there are. You might not like where I work because of that, because there is a lot of discussion going on at my job. That's not even in my department, it's like the department across from me. Because they have to. Take phone calls up with like other like locations that we're like associated with. So you hear them talking a lot, and then they'll also just start rambling about like anything else, <laughs> just life. But to me, I feel like I can block that out because they're not really talking to me directly. Like if they were trying to have a conversation with me, that would distract me. But if I can tell they're just yapping and just talking in general, I can block that out and focus on what I need to do. I'm an asshole. <laughs> no, you're not. First off, no, you're not. Um, I am a misanthrope in the office and I don't care about most of the people I work with. Well, that's understandable too. I feel that. <laughs> also, I need to 100% create a restore point before I get myself killed here. But I think I know how to get out. I kind of like this puzzle mechanic. Can I? Yep. Beat it. Sort of. All right, we're almost out. <laughs> all right, I might just blow them all up. It's just easier to deal with. I need to get to a healing room. Badly. I want to go to the data room, but I need to get to a healing room. I should just get to the data room. We're here. Do all these people send me an email? Message me that they send me an email, then walk at my desk and ask if their message about seeing their email all within thirty seconds. <laughs> yeah, that's annoying. Diffusion added to missiles. Charge with R, fire with B. Diffusion. Hex diffusion. What can't my missiles do at this point? <laughs> so sorry, my sinuses are just all over the place today. Or at least at this very moment. <laughs> Hmm. 
There's gotta be the way to get out of here. Nothing? Then when I see an email and say, okay, I'll do that once I'm done with this email. You. They start to tell me about their kids' recitals. I'm like, you're about your daughter's recitals. <laughs> I, I actually understand that. <laughs> there is one guy in my office that's very, very much like that. He's a good guy. It's just. Yeah. Yeah, I get that. Oh, wait, can I just. I just wanna, I just wanna get out. <laughs> All right. Maybe I can't go this way. There's another path I could take. If I can get that way. Oh wait, no, I can't. What can I missiles do? Also, I think I just got the last upgrade. <laughs> Like crap. Um, all right. No, there's actually. Uh, all right, I'll talk about like a teeny bit. So there's like a guy that I work with that, uh, He'll kind of go, go around being like, like I, he's like the veteran here. Like he knows what he's talking about. And like, um, what the fuck was that? Oh. Oh. Okay then. <laughs> I did not realize that's what that was gonna do. Um, that was awesome. What is this? Four to six? This feels like a Mario shortcut. Can't get through that. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> Interesting. Um, but yeah, the guy, he... Again, good guy. But there's just some things I feel like you tell him and it just goes through one ear and then doesn't exactly go through the other ear as it should. But uh, he would essentially just be like, he would give you the lay down, like how everything is. And it's just, he's just, I don't know. It's hard to describe. I said, no, how that works now. He's just not very good. I don't know. With his job. Nice guy. It's... Yeah. <laughs> Essentially, that's it. He's just a nice guy. What am I supposed to do here? Hold up. Oh. I'm like looking at him like, what the hell? 
I'm aware of those fun people. Yeah. He's just, yeah. <laughs> That's all I got. It's just, yeah. It's just a yeah. worked. Just curious if I can actually go through here. I know I can't. Never mind. Just realized there's no way I'm going to be able to. That's an interesting ability for a, a missile. Whoops. <laughs> and that's why I made a restore point. <laughs> All right, at least I know I can't go that way, so that's fine. Um, let's go back up. I need to desperately heal, and there's one right above me. Okay. <laughs> that makes me feel a million times more comfortable now. Get to the navigation room. I've gotten like two upgrades before I was even able to get to one of them. I'm starting to wonder if I was actually supposed to get to a navigation room before I ended up finding this missile upgrade. And I just completely skipped it. <laughs> Alright, you're upgrading your missiles? That's unusual. There was no word from headquarters. A procedural error, I'm sure. Even so, I did not approve of bypassing security level 4. From now on, you'll use more discretion. In any case, Samus, do you remember the security robot you faced earlier? I believe the X has infected it. That is to say, they have claimed the organic components that form its neural network it has entered Sector 6. I don't know what it's planning, but let's not wait and find out. Samus, you know what to do. Alright. I like, <laughs> like the AI is essentially like, you're doing things I did not tell you to do. Stop it. <laughs> Listen to me. <laughs> Which I wonder if that could be part of the story too. Anyway. Yeah, it's clear. Uh, it's sector six quickly. All right. So we have that robot to beat up. Whatever it is. I think I'm just getting to the Sector 6 navigation room and then my wrap there. We're getting close maybe to the end? I feel like we're getting close to the end. I don't know how much more we're going to have left. Because I feel like we've almost explored like all the secret areas in each area, but who knows? We have not explored much of Sector uh, 6. Other than when we first went here. The security robot seems to have gotten much stronger. This worries me. Be careful. But we have another problem. Don't know where it is. Once you're done, leave and knock immediately. The SAX is tracking you. Oh, crap. Alright, that's clear enough. Don't stay longer than you must. Understood. So, the same as suits tracking me. And yeah, it's great. <laughs> All right. So I am going to wrap here. So I say thank y'all for watching, chilling, relaxing, lurking. I really do appreciate it. I am getting tired. <laughs> it's getting late here. It's almost after 11 <laughs> so that's my cue to be like okay i gotta wrap up um yeah thank you for thank you for here mistake i appreciate it. everyone else here steak number ace oh geez llama um everyone was able to stop in lurk abstract everyone appreciate it 